Yeah! <laughs> We're live! Welcome, everybody. Thank you guys so much for joining us today. Um, we have been having such a fun time um, putting these pieces together for you. And so today I am bringing you um, the, the Seasons, uh, the Pictures of the Seasons by Daniel Luna. And uh, we have some really cool artwork that he recently brought in um, that have to do with the fall weather, um, some of the upcoming holidays as well. And uh, we have many different pieces all um, around the winery. They're online for you to take a look at uh, that are um, in alignment with the holidays that are, that are up and coming. And I can't believe that we're already talking about the holidays. So let's jump right into it. Thank you guys so much for joining us. And let me see if I can get on live just in case. If you guys have any comments, go ahead and uh, just drop them in uh, the comment bar and we'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Please share with us. It's Friday night. What are you guys doing for your happy hour? What are you sipping on tonight um, as you're watching the show? Um, I actually made some mold white wine um, for, <clears throat> for a little treat. So that was, I made that earlier. I boiled it um, in the pot, put um, some of the sunny side white and a little bit of the dry Riesling in it, a little bit of our peach wine juice, and then I added um, uh, some of the spices to it so it's boiling up and it'll be super yummy especially for this cold cold weather so what are you guys sipping on now let me see i don't know if i should let me see if i can get this on so i can see who's who's live with us all of these pieces as i just mentioned are available on um on our website and everything is updated on there so if you'd like any of these pieces that i show today or anything um, that you see i would say definitely get it right away because his artwork goes really really fast so i would like to start these pieces are a little bit bigger um and but they are gorgeous so many different colors involved this one is one of my favorites it's called cosmic wine and cheese and this is priced at 105 and um, it looks like a little Chianti bottle, which is very cool. Um, and like a little genie coming out of the bottle. And then the grapes on the bottom with the cheese. And so these are great for your kitchen, entertaining your guests. Well, I guess five of you, four of your guests at your house these days. Um, very beautiful piece. And very colorful. And another piece that I just love, I don't know how many of you love Halloween, but it is one of my favorite holidays. Although I was born on the 4th of July, Halloween is still my favorite holiday. And every year I, I really try to go all out, go big. And um, we do have some of his art pieces that uh, uh, hang up um, um, every year for the holidays. And so one of the pieces that caught my eye, it's, okay, I guess, it, yeah, it goes that way. It's called the Spirit, Spooky Spirit Wine. And this one has uh, some cute little pumpkins down here with fire coming out of them. Again, the Chianti bottle. I love um, his inspiration here um, with the wine goddess coming out and squeezing the grapes on top of the pumpkins. And then the grapes are catching on fire. So how very interesting how appropriate this is for this time of year. Um, knock on wood that everybody is uh, very safe from the fires and that all the grapes are safe as well. I think at this point they've all been picked, so hopefully they're, they're good to go and, and ready to uh, ferment and, and get into the bottle. So this is priced at $65. And I'm not seeing anything on here, so I want to make sure... Okay, perfect. So I'll turn it down. All right. Hi, Mom. Thanks for joining. Hi, Shelly. Cannot play the video. Hmm. Okay, it looks clear on my end. I'm not sure. Um, maybe just uh, get out of the screen and then and bring it back on. So, um, but it looks like it's, it's going through here. All right, wonderful. So the next one, uh, this one is really, really cool. Looks like this girl is... Uh, trick-or-treating it's called the quiet trick or treat and uh, this beautiful woman that he loves to paint is holding um, this pumpkin looks like her candy sack and then she's looking in to this young man here and then the fall um, leaves I love how he painted um, the stars they're all different colors orange yellow browns and he does that in this painting as well 
And so this beautiful piece is priced at $65. All right, great. And we do have available all of these beautiful pots that Daniel Luna brought in, uh, many different sizes. I'm going to grab one, hopefully that spider, nope, there he is, there's a spider that's been jumping <laughs> through the pots. So please um, just let me know if you're interested in the pots. I would be happy to schedule a time for you to either come in um, and, and look at all of the pots or I can uh, text a photo to you as well. 303-477-3535 um, is my direct uh, line that you can get a hold of me. But he has many different uh, shapes and sizes of the pots. Still good during the winter time. You can grow uh, many different herbs uh, in those pots. I know it's kind of a sad time of year because all the flowers and uh, vegetables, um, uh, it's going to be really cold Sunday, Monday, so those might all go away after this weekend. So it's time to now welcome winter. All right, so what have I not shown yet? Okay, this beautiful piece, this is called Autumn Legend. And one of the things I love how, how Daniel paints is it's very fluid. And uh, what I mean by that is we have the leaves up here and then they turn into like the books or he has the grapes that, that turn into the wine. And so I love that fluidity that he does on a lot of his paintings as well. Another um, piece of it is that these beautiful knot holes, he doesn't paint over them. Um, they, they go with the painting, so they're a part of it as well. And I love that connection that he does. So uh, this would be good if you love books, love reading, love fall. And then the beautiful sky painted with pinks and blues and green. So it's just beautiful all the way around. And this beautiful piece is $85. And I love this one. So this is a, a very small. You can put it in uh, between um, you know, two doors in your house. And, um, or it fits in your kitchen. But I love this. It's called Hot Flight. This female pilot is um, smoking a pipe with tobacco, I think. Yep, this one is tobacco <laughs> versus some of his other, <laughs> what it, the other paintings that they're smoking. Um, yeah, it's very Amelia Earhart-ish, uh, very, very cute. She has the plane she's holding. Um, looks like one of the wings is caught on flyer, so hot flight for you. And this um, beautiful piece is $50. All right. Okay, great. Um, now, one of the, this piece reminds me so much of, um, I lived in Valencia, Spain at one point in my life, and one of the festivals that they do there is they say goodbye to winter and they welcome spring. And how they do this, and I might have mentioned this before, is they build these beautiful paper mache um, figurines in every single neighborhood. And they party, and I'm telling you party, for 24 hours straight um, throughout the entire month. And then at the very end, they burn these beautiful paper mache um, figurines down to the ground. And it's just a way of saying goodbye to winter and welcoming spring. And the reason I bring that up is because I'm very reminded of this and how we're all connected seasonally, how all the seasons are just connected. And, and you know, um, with global warming, it's hard to see it more and more. But there's such a connection between each season um, and the moods and the energy and uh, the moon and everything that that's just connected and, and what brings with it. And so this reminded me of um, of that month of Fayas is what they call it. Um, you've got. Um, you know, the holiday here with the pumpkin, um, the Halloween, moving into maybe Thanksgiving, um, which is, or the fall, and then you have the winter time, which, um, you know, always reminds me of the, the holidays that come in December, um, Hanukkah or Christmas or whatever you celebrate. And uh, so I just love this full connection. And fall is one of my favorite times of year um, because I love the cold weather and I just Feel like he brings that all to light. He reminds me of drinking yummy wine and reading really good books by a fire, um, the fire of which I don't have. But, <laughs> but nonetheless, it's it's fun to uh, be cozy inside um, and uh, have shelter. You know, definitely blessed for that in these times of year. But this is a beautiful piece. It's called the History of Autumn and Winter. Very appropriate. And this piece is ninety dollars. All right. 
And I think this is, I didn't show this one yet, did I? I don't think so. Okay, so this one is, um, this beautiful piece is called Sugar Skull Wind Wine. Also, I love this. It starts with the fall up top, and, um, and then we have uh, the wine goddess with the serape, and it looks like she's pouring grape juice um, into the, the skulls, uh, the sugar skulls. We also will be celebrating El Dia de los Muertos here very, very soon. Um, and I know some of you already have your altars set up. Um, some are there year-round, but this is um, definitely a part, uh, a part of history um, in my family as well. So it's a beautiful piece, all the wonderful colors, and the representation that it has so appropriate for this time of year. And, yeah. and so it's painted. Um, I love how he takes these old wood pieces and he refurbishes them and then puts his beautiful artwork on, on the front. So that looks like everything new uh, that he has brought in. And uh, like I said, I today I just updated the website and took off all the pieces that have already been purchased. So um, feel free to get on our website and purchase a piece. I know Daniel and his family uh, greatly appreciate your support and that he has a place to um, show his art as he's going through his own transitions as an artist uh, during during COVID. And so um, it's interesting to see his evolution uh, from when he started painting to now and, and how the times are so um, in alignment with, uh, with what he puts into his artwork. And we talked about that when we interviewed him last time. And then we all have a creative space that we can go into. And so uh, we'd love to hear from you what you guys are doing. Drop some comments um, in the comment bar. Uh, wh what are you doing that um, that, that is lighting, igniting your um, creative, artistic uh, talents? Is there something you picked up during this time? And then also, um, if we would love for you to get some exclusive deals. If you text WINE to 28398, that's 28398, we are actually um, doing deals of the day, deals of the week, and that exclusively goes to you who opt in to get um, our text messages. And so Paul and I will be bringing you a lot of fun, um, creative ways to save money when you're in here and um, purchase some yummy wine from us. And so um, if you text that to 28398, I believe that will generate the daily deal that we sent out today, and that ends um, at midnight tonight. So wonderful. Well, thank you guys so much for joining. And uh, I didn't see any comments, but um, if you drop a comment, I'll definitely make sure to reply to that. But other than that, have a wonderful weekend. Cheers. Thanks again so much for supporting our business, supporting local businesses. And uh, let's all work to keep everyone healthy and safe and um, abundantly well. Take care. Bye.